welcome back to Gamecasters. I'm Ryan, and today we're playing Layers of Fear. This is one of last year's released horror games, I believe. But um, this game actually takes an interesting twist. I believe it was kind of based on the Silent Hills PT playable trailer or whatever. Um, you play as a guy that is a painter, he has schizophrenia. And it takes a lot of dark turns throughout the story. Um, and we're going to do an entire series on this. I hope you guys are looking forward to entering in to this world with me. Because this is going to be one hell of a ride. Um, I don't know if I will be finding all of the um, pages. I went. I went. Look. I cannot speak right now. Apparently, I went through the achievements on here, and there's a few of them for finding like all the pages and all the collectibles and stuff. And I'll do my best to find those along the way, but I really just want to show you guys the story behind this because it's really interesting, and I feel like it's going to be a great series to do. I know how you must feel. I feel oh, great. Lost, alone, hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. Oscar Wilde, the picture of Darian Gray. Now, something I'm going to point out to you guys before we start this is pay attention to what he says in some of the notes that I'll be reading along the way because a lot of it has to do with what the story is about. And if you figure it out before the end, don't spoil it for anybody in the comments. I will delete comments that if anybody spoils it for anyone that has not seen the end to this yet. Because I really want you guys to experience this to its fullest aspects. Dear Sir, we would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialists, as well as refrain from sending any more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not fa take kindly to such accusations. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of rodent infestation of any kind and as such decided not to act. Further than a profilic spraying, please treat this letter as a final warning or else the next envelope you receive will be from our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Denton, Pesky Pest Pacification Company. Now, um, I did read that note, but as I go through this, um, I'll I'll sit there on the note long enough to where you can pause it and read through all of them yourselves because I'll, there's a lot of notes in this game and it's going to take way too much time for me to read them myself and we'll be using up a lot of video time. So I'll give you guys time to read them, but if you can and you're interested, do read them. Alright. So you can inspect multiple um, different containers and stuff on here, which is another thing like I was pointing out for the notes and such. Um, it's kind of got like an amnesia feel, like you do have to like hold the trigger and move the door yourself. Um, but like I said, I'm not really going to try to find all the notes if you're interested in the backstory. Um, you can find that probably on the uh, wikia or something for it. But I will be exploring, so I'll be doing that at least. I believe there, yeah, there's nothing in there. 
Also, if you're wondering, uh, I don't know if it's showing up on the video. There's a little bit of frame loss. It's, it's, uh, it's because of the game. I noticed even when I'm not streaming and like no matter what I do to the settings and whatnot, it still gets a little shaky at times. I think that's just because the game's uh, still sort of new. So bear with me on that aspect. A note right here. One below knee prothesis. How the hell did they fuck up the link? Oh, that'd be really shitty. Like, you have to go through all that trouble to get a uh, prosthetic leg, and then they fuck up on the length of it. That would suck. Like, I already lost my leg. Do you really want to put me through more? <laughs> ah, the controls. I hate this. This is another reason why I might not be looking for all the notes, just because some of the controls are a little bit wonky. Sorry for yesterday, you were right. I overreacted. It's just that this isn't about me, it's about her. Everything I do, I do with her best interest in mind. I guess I've always believed that in an imperfect world, it's worth to strive for perfection. Ah, uh, now I'm starting to sound like my father. I will work on my temper, though. Promise. We'll talk later. I love you. Aw, I love you too. Well, I didn't find the trap house, but I found the trap closet. Literally. Alright, so I'm actually going to start focusing on getting through this now. I figured I'd show you guys a little bit of the, uh, the starter point so you can get at least introduced to the story. Can you chill? You're at a 7. Bring it down, down to about a 2. Thank you. I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you tonight. It's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promise. Oh, that's creepy. Oh shit. Oh damn. Well, uh, Little Red Riding Hood took a. Oh damn! Little Red Riding Hood took a really dark turn. Yeah, here's another long note. I'll let you guys pause and read through that. Like I said, I'm not going to read all the notes. Save some time. Otherwise, like, I would love to read through all these for you guys and let you guys get the entire story, but I, I really don't have, you know, this would, this would become a really long story or video series if I did that. So. How about no? Sorry, couldn't sleep. The leg's been acting up again. Figured I might as well do some work. I love you. From an outside perspective, you would think everything is fine in this house. But, in all honesty, you can tell that something's oddly off. In their world. Uh, this is a lot of drawers to go through. They're just close up as a note. Alright, you guys can pause for that one. I don't believe. Yeah, I can't go through that door yet. It's locked. So I'm going to move down here. And this key goes to this. Sir, I didn't touch the workshop, just like you asked, although I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Now this is the, uh, the checkpoint kind of system, the save room. So we'll, uh... 
this is where we'll start off at. Uh, there's six chapters to this. Uh, they progressively progressively get longer uh, the further you get into the game. So. And as we progress through here, this painting will change and it'll warp until we get the full picture. Also, as you collect the notes, this letter actually will get more complete. That's also why it says finish it at the bottom, which is uh, what I was saying. If you collect all the notes, you get more of the story behind everything. I'm so sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. Come talk to me when you're done before you go to sleep. I don't know if they put the note in the drawer or they just put it there after reading it, excuse me. And looks like that's all there is to read. And just some art supplies. All right. And this is where Layers of Fear begins. <sighs> I hate that every time. Like, I know it's coming, but... It still gets me. Did that chair just move? Uh, I hate playing these games. I love the stories behind the horror games. Oh, so this is another thing. The world does change as you go through it. So don't expect me to go in through too many familiar areas. Nothing stays the same. And also, that's a reference to it, going in circles. <sighs> I have a love in my heart for horror games. And I love the stories behind them. Oh boy, oh boy, do I hate playing through them. I prefer being the watcher. <laughs> um, also, if you guys haven't seen the videos on Outlast 2 yet, we are definitely going to be continuing that series. I want to finish that game, I just haven't gotten around to it yet. Ah. <sighs> That chill down the spine. Four eight five. All right. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? This guy's got a Morgan Freeman voice. It's also kind of weird. I found that same ring in the uh, room. Oh, wait, look closer. What do you mean? What am I looking for? Is there something I'm looking for on here? Is there something written? see any writing on it. I never actually realized that. It said look closer, but... Huh. Oh, wait. Is there something to do with those symbols? I don't know. If you guys know something, let me know in the comments below, because I, I actually never realized it said look closer on there, but I, I myself, I didn't see anything. But I might have missed something, so... Uh, how about no? Also, I hate how the doors close behind you. And they lock. So there's, like, no turning back. You've been snooping around my workshop again for the last time. You are not allowed in that room. Even if the door happens to be open, I forbid it. This is your last warning. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. I understand have rules and stuff, but like the guy's your like butler or whatever he is, but you know like 
I don't know. I mean, unless you... Well, I guess from what it sounds like, he has told him before not to go in there, but... He's really just doing his job more than anything. Like, I don't know. Personal knowledge. Is that... That's a baby hanging on the wall. Baby! Are you okay, baby? Oh! I'm not okay! Oh, I'm not okay. Okay. Not okay. Not okay. I fell through the floor. And it's dark in here. Even this candle doesn't do shit for lighting. Oh god, cat. Link, you scared me. You did me a right spook. Meow. Oh, I'm so not ready for this. Secret passageways through the house. Spud has joined me in the background. What's up, Pete? Oh, shit! Shit, oh? Shit, oh? Shitty o's. My favorite cereal. Speaking of which, uh, this is completely off topic from what just happened, but recently I went to FYE. And there was literally a cereal in there called Bootios. Need it. <laughs> Love the booty. Booty, booty, bat, nigga. Ain't deep lies. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like This is some straight Titanic shit right that. here. I want to get oh. all. Oh, wait. Not... Curves just right. I'm not that round. <laughs> oh, everything slowed down for a second. Okay. <laughs> Okay, that's a broken bottle on the floor. Uh, and that rat just straight ran into the fire. Okay, filled rat stew. One Did it just, rapidash. Those rats just keep running into the fireplace. Bro, they just want to be a rapidash, that's why. <laughs> but they're not horses. <laughs> we, want, we don't want to be no rat tat tat tata. <laughs> Like we can't compare with that rapidash. Just burn ourselves in yeah. hopes that the evolution will kick in. Yeah, sacrifice yourself like a borderland. Fucking what was it, matchsticks? Okay. Just instantaneous acid trip right there. Wait, is that why you disappeared? Yeah, yes it is. Oh, I'm not oh Jesus! What the fuck was that, man? Hmm, I completely forgot about that. Well, you guys, I have played this before, but <laughs> I completely forgot about some of the things on here, so I'm still going to get some initial reaction from this. Oh, boy. Scared me too. <laughs> There's another note. Have fun reading. I'm not reading that shit. <laughs> you can to read it. Fuck yo. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. And that lady, whoever's crying in the background... Okay, yeah, yeah, that's, it's a good thing that door's locked. You stay in there. You stay in there. Dude looks like a lady! And that is a song reference. I'm not trying to offend. <laughs> well, it's getting cold in here. Someone says to fire it up, so... <laughs> Hey man, you gotta do what you gotta do, like. You heard that, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm known as the perfect potato. <laughs> hey. First like step is the hardest. Potato. See, see, the game's even agreeing with you, Tanner. The first step is the hardest. You just gotta take initiative. <laughs> I don't know if I should take initiative over that. <laughs> <laughs> it's not good, I don't think. <laughs> oh. Bye. It's fruity in here. So. Okay, what did that do? I pressed the wait, but it didn't do anything. I forget. Uh. 
Okay, I hear noises, but it's not giving me a direction, so I don't know where the noises come from, and that freaks me out. So... What the fuck? Is this... Okay, that's, that's the lock. Okay, so pressing this did do something. I don't know what. It made noises. Noises happen. Can I... Is there something on this painting? Or like, what am I supposed to do here? It's been a while since I've played through this, so... Forgive me for forgetting what I'm doing. I swear I had to go through this. Okay! That's a knife! Um, um, yeah, this, this door can stay closed. Yeah, I, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to open that. Oh, the acid's kicking in again. Um, do I have to look at the freaky acid trip painting? Okay. Well, we're not running out of food anytime soon. Like, shit, if I can just paint food and it pops right out of the painting, shit, I mean... First, I go oh. for a canvas. Not just any canvas. And yes, this is what you're I thinking it is. Knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then... Carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hand steady. That's fucked up, man. That's really fucked up. Like, like, like you use skin as a canvas. Like, that's creepy as shit. I'm just gonna press that weight. Like, I'm pretty weighted down here right now. And that is the end of chapter one. Deep breaths. Remember, you're a professional. It's just the first few strokes. And then you're over the hump. What's so hard about it? So... I think there's one more part of the sentence on there. This room is very empty now. Also, this is like I was saying, this painting changes every time you finish a chapter. And it eventually morphs into what the final painting is. And you can get different endings to the painting from what I'm aware if you find all the notes it does change which is another thing I was talking about the uh, stuff you can find throughout the game does help you get the full story so that's where chapter one ends and also where this episode is going to end I am looking forward to finishing this series with you guys uh, this book keeps all the pictures it looks like I might have missed quite a few. I'm not sure. I don't know if they go in order. No, it doesn't look like it because there's a few notes that are further down in this book than you would expect them to be. So, anyways, thanks for joining me. Don't forget to check out the links in the description. It's dangerous to go alone. Check out our sponsor, FatalGrips.com. Use promo code GameCasters for 10% off of any purchase on their website. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next video.